you. Um, actually, we added two more speakers and they really a surprise because we want to talk beyond ideas, we want to show you the real thing. And we invited two technopreneurs here today to, to talk about their story. So after me, we will have Gian Scott Havidona, who is a student, but at the same time, he's a 19-year-old CEO of his own company. So, who's 19 here? Sana, in, in two, three months, you'll be CEO of your company, okay? And then we have Peter here, Peter Cotton. He's also CEO of his company. And he has a lot more stories to tell. Gian is just starting his own company. Peter has started several companies already. So, and he will share you with lots of things and trials that you're going to go through. But he's pursued. Anyway, I just want to make this quick and share with you what ideas this is all about. Um, this is what I want to tell you. We also have a national competition ongoing. And then bootcamps. You will experience this this afternoon. And why we believe bootcamps are mutually beneficial to idea space, you and your school, and ISEC as well. Okay, this is. Does anyone know where this is? Silicon Valley. Okay, and then. It's home to the largest technology companies and thousands of startups. Our chairman, Mr. Pangilinan, said, I want you guys to bring Silicon Valley to the Philippines. First reaction is, you mean bring these companies here? Well, some of them are here already. He said, no, it's not bringing these companies here. But he said, bring the culture of Silicon Valley to the Philippines. Why? What is so unique about this culture? In Silicon Valley, everybody works together. When someone's got an idea, people share it right away. They talk about it, they go to forums, and then they meet a lawyer, and the lawyer says, hey, come on, let's get together, let's put your company together and start something. And that's what Silicon Valley is. A lot of sharing, a lot of helping, and that's what we want to do in the Philippines. Can we do it? Well, hopefully with Idea Space and the other incubators. Peter actually also starting an incubator, and hopefully other companies. I think Globe has also started a uh, incubator. So we're so happy that more and more companies and conglomerates are starting to reach out and help people, small entrepreneurs, micro-entrepreneurs, start something and more hopefully start something big. So that's what we want to do. We, Idea Space has brought together, um, is bringing together actually all, all, these, all these players in the whole ecosystem to help people with their ideas and bring them to reality. This is the Philippines today, pretty fragmented, right? But all these words, sorry, all these words are right there, just waiting to happen. Innovation, disruptive, game-changing, all of these things we want to put together and make, bring ideas, I mean, Philippines make it a part of the world map. So, I don't know if anyone of you know the story, but when the logo of the United Nations was being made, Carlos P. Romano, um, he's somewhat important in our history, he's the small guy who walked behind MacArthur, and uh, when they were making the logo of the UN, he asked the logo maker, Where's the Philippines there? The logo maker said, it's too small, sir. If you put the Philippines there, it's just going to be a tiny dot. But he goes, well, just put the dot there. Uh, so that's what we want to be. The Philippines, really, we're a small country in this whole world. But we still want to make sure people notice the dot. 
Okay, why do we put so much emphasis on entrepreneurship? On the left side, that is how much the Philippines produces. On the right side, that is how much only six companies in the U.S. produce. Only. And so, it's not counting the Procter & Gamble, not counting the other Dow Chemical, all these other big American firms that make a mark in the world. Only these six companies. But, we want to emphasize that in the six companies, they all started with two people. Two people with an idea. Let's focus on the two people on the right. They're from HP. HP was founded in 1939, long, long ago. Maybe your great grandparents were still around. But they started here. They say in Silicon Valley, when you go on a tour, I haven't gone there yet. Hope I could go one of these days. They show this garage. This garage happened to be the garage when Mr. Hewlett and Mr. Packard started working. Huh? So Mr. Pangilinan asked us, can we create the culture of the valley? And can we create the version of the garage in the Philippines? So we hope to make Idea Space the birth, birthplace of our own garage in our own Silicon Valley. But one of our one of our contributors to Idea Space said, "So Filipinas, we don't develop our businesses in the garage because we mga garahin natin malamok. <laughs> so we have this to offer you. It's not a garage but an office in the heart of Makati where we want." to house companies who want to start up. I'll tell you more of what services we're going, we, could, we do to help people start businesses. Idea Space is a foundation. It's a non-profit foundation. So all the companies of, um, put together are chaired by Mr. Pangilinan, Manny Pangilinan. We put, they put, they all contribute Money. Every year, all these companies put together contribute 100 million pesos to help startup companies. So a portion of that 100 million pesos is given out to companies to start up. Okay. And that is one of, just one of our contributions to nation building. Because there's so many ways to build a nation. You have poverty allegation, you have building houses, we have really electricity to homes, etc. But for us, we formed a new foundation and um, Idea Space is here to help the young technopreneurs or actually anybody feeling young. So just to familiarize with who, who are the benefactors of Idea Space, um, we have here Smart, Thank you, Smart, also for helping us live more today. And then uh, PLDT, SBI Global, Indofood is an, our Indonesian company in Indonesia. We're the largest noodle maker in East Asia. And then TV5, and then we have a mining company called Philex, and all, all these companies, they're all helping us make, bring ideas to reality. Our goal really is to develop and nurture innovation and entrepreneurship by delivering a support program. So what is this, this, what is this support program all about? Our program provides funding. First of all, when you have an idea, right? You need money. A lot of times in our society, who do we call on? Who my parents, mommy and daddy? Mommy and daddy. Kung ay pera ang uncle, kung uh, si Tito. Kung nasa abroad si Tita, call Tita. But, what about those who don't want to call a family? And what about those who don't want to go to the 5-6? <laughs> 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 <laughs>
here we will provide funding, startup funding, but not too much money naman. Diba? When you have too much money, you kind of want to spend it. We need to be hungry at first. And then when you start a business, sometimes people have lots of money, but then they blow it. So it's important to have a mentor when you are starting something. And we have put together, as, a, as I said, we have lots of a community of people who want to help people grow their businesses. Then, for example, you develop an app and you want to try it. When you knock on the door of Smart, who's going to mind you? You're so small, who are you? So, we provide an access to the resources of the conglomerate of the First Pacific Group. Say, for example, you invented something that can be used in our hospitals. You knock on the door of the door of Makati Men. Um, Mrs. President Rose Montenegro, I would like to present my product. She would say, who are you? Usually, that's our problem when we're a small bank entrepreneur. People don't believe us first and they don't want to give us a break. Hopefully, what we're going to do is give you, help you find doors and open the doors for you so you don't have to, you don't have to struggle and convince people that you have a good idea that can be grown into a viable business. Oh, this is too small. So I think I'm going to skip it. Anyway, this is just the components uh, of what I call the funding, etc.